A long time ago, in a small village surrounded by big mountains, there was a young boy called Bodhi. Bodhi was very curious and loved to explore new places. He wanted to have an adventure that would change his life. Every day, he would go to the top of the highest mountain, hoping to find a secret that would make him happy. One sunny morning, as Bodhi went higher than ever before, he saw an old temple hidden among some cherry blossom trees. He was interested in its mystery, so he carefully went inside. He felt very peaceful as if the temple was hugging his heart and soul. In the middle of the temple's yard, there was a beautiful golden lotus, its petals moving softly to a hidden music. Bodhi was amazed by its magic and he wanted to touch it. As he got closer, the air felt alive and the lotus started to spin. All of a sudden, a calm and wise voice spoke in the temple. Young Bodhi, you want to learn the truth and the power to change the world. But remember, true learning is not in the end, but in the way you get there. Shocked by the strange voice, Bodhi asked, Great Lotus, how can I start such a way of learning? The voice kindly said, You must go to the five elemental peaks, where you will face the tests of earth, water, fire, air, and the spirit of life. Only then will you discover the hidden gift inside yourself. With new courage, Bodhi began his amazing journey. His first test was at the earth peak, where he met a huge stone giant that stopped him from going on. The giant saw that Bodhi was honest and gave him a puzzle that tested his thinking skills. With smartness and creativity, Bodhi solved the puzzle, and the stone giant turned into dust, showing a way ahead. At the water peak, Bodhi faced a wild river that tried to wash him away. Using his inner power, he closed his eyes and let the water move him. Amazingly, the river took him to a safe place, rewarding his trust in the way of life. The fire peak was the hardest test. Bodhi found himself standing among big flames that burned with strong energy. He was scared, but he remembered the temple's teachings. Feeling calm, Bodhi focused his mind and breathed out, putting out the flames one by one until he won. Next was the air peak, where Bodhi fought winds that tried to push him off the mountain. Feeling each breath as an important connection, he balanced himself and moved with the wind, making his body and soul work together. By doing this, the wind became his friend, gently taking him to the last peak. Finally, Bodhi got to the Essence Peak, where he saw a wonderful sight, a shining crystal cave full of life. Inside it, he found the end of his journey, a bright pearl showing the learning and kindness he had gained. Feeling very thankful, Bodhi ran back to the temple, wanting to share his new gift with the world. As he reached the lotus, a glowing person appeared before him, saying, You did it, Bodhi. The power to change the world is inside you. In a flash, Bodhi went back home and realized that he was different forever. With learning and kindness, he helped others to start their journeys of change, spreading love and peace throughout the village and beyond. And so, dear viewers, we learn that the best gifts are often inside ourselves, just like Bodhi, each of us has the chance to be great and to make others happy. Enjoy your special journey and may your heart always have the magic of the hidden lotus. If you like this story, please subscribe to our channel, like this video, comment on your thoughts and share it with your friends. Thank you for watching.